It is good. It's been so great. Uh, I mean, temperatures today are below average. Portland, Vancouver, 78 degrees. All that's changing, though, for the weekend. So enjoy it while you can. 78 right now. Vancouver, as we look in the distance, if you squint, you can see Mount Hood just behind that building and Pearson Field off to the right side of your screen. Bend, downtown temperature 80 degrees. This place is going to be heating up too this weekend. Skamania Lodge 75. Uh, great wind if you're going to be on the Columbia River doing some kiteboarding. It's been pretty active out there. Lincoln City 65. The wind here is going. We're talking about 30, 35 miles per hour, mostly out of the north. You can see the white caps way out there on the ocean. Not to mention the incoming waves, too. So, wind driven waves, uh, that's going to be a deal for you tonight, tomorrow. But by Sunday, things really start to calm down. Relative humidity right now, of course, is very dry out there. Central Oregon down through eastern Oregon in the single digits and teens here. And then we notice up and down the valley, we're in the 30% range overall. A sustained winds, the Dows, up to about 22 miles per hour out of the west. That really hasn't changed much at all this afternoon. Out of the northwest, down through Madras, out of the north, Redmond, down through Bend, again up to about 20 miles per hour. Strongest winds we just showed you on the camera. Lincoln City now getting gusts up to about 32 miles per hour. Wind gusts forecast through tonight, 11 o'clock, almost midnight. It's still going to be windy through the Dalles on the east side of the gorge, up to about 14 miles per hour. Although that wind really just kind of drops off. Tomorrow morning, almost calm conditions, picks back up again. Tomorrow afternoon, about 5, 6.30, 17 miles per hour. This is a little bit less than what we're dealing with today, so small changes through tomorrow. Noticing that's the same scenario for uh, Ben all the way down through uh, Madras and Prineville. Now we get to Sunday, Sunday, different story. Now everything is heating up, so it's still very dry. That's a big concern for firefighting efforts. But now the wind direction and the wind speed changes. So noticing now we're seeing those winds out of the north, northeast, between about 5 to 10 miles per hour. So although the wind speed won't be nearly as strong, the wind direction is important because we have all the smoke sitting up here in north central Oregon. We've had moderate air quality. Now that wind direction is going to be changing, pushing the smoke towards the west, southwest instead, whereas it's been coming from the west and going out towards the east. So we will watch that carefully on Sunday to see if that affects our air quality. Of course, it has to pass through the gorge and the mountains to even affect us, but we'll see how that goes. Our only forecast through tonight, your temperatures will be dropping off into the look at that Salem, 47 degrees. Even this morning, it was pretty chilly out there. Well, for this time of year, 51 degrees for you, Portland, tomorrow morning about 6 o'clock. You'll have some clouds at the coast lingering over to uh, Vancouver and Longview. Your temperatures tomorrow afternoon will be noticeably warmer, low 80s. Sunday morning, waking up to the low to mid 50s, and virtually no clouds to deal with all the way through Sunday afternoon. Ridge of high pressure takes over, and it's all about the heat starting on Sunday, lasting through Tuesday of next week. Here's your seven day forecast. Look at that. So, another nice day tomorrow, 81, but Sunday, 93, and then nearly 100 on Monday. Well, thank you for that forecast. Sure. <laughs> we'll be right back.